want you to know that it's our time You and me bleed the same light I want you to know that I'm all yours You and me are on the same course I'm slipping down a chain reaction And here I go, here I go, here I go, go And once again I'm yours in fractions It takes me down, pulls me down, pulls me down low A-frame four points, so if you put that on, under the A-frame, again facing in so everyone can see it, perfect, yeah, and just right in the middle, yeah, facing in, perfect, okay, Keter seesaw, three points, okay, so that can go by the seesaw, again, in the middle, facing in, okay, long jump, spread, tyre, tunnels, Two. And two. Okay. Long jump. Put that by the long jump. And that by the tyre as well for me. And the wall, I think, will be two points as well. So I, if I'm going to be in the middle, I need to be able to see it. So, yeah, put it this, this side. Okay? This side the long jump. So, yeah, right place. Just, yeah, perfect. 
Yeah, thanks. That's a good idea, we use the 12s. Yeah, let's see. Cool. Okay, so I want you to put 12 by these two tunnels, okay? Just put 12 by that and the yeah, that purple one, just again, put it in the middle, on the middle sandbag, yeah, middle sandbag facing in, okay? Genius. I've just had a really good idea. Watch this. <laughs> Perfect. Okay, you can do the same on that one, okay? Two, two, brilliant. This tunnel's tire. Tire. Two, nothing. Twenty. So let's do it with two, 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 three, two, five, five, four, three. Everything else is one. The tunnel. Actually, is a two as well in the gamble. Okay, brilliant. That's how you set up the gamblers. <laughs> Perfect. Perfect. Brilliant, thank you. Okay. okay, right. Gamblers class, okay? I'm assuming this is quite new, so what I thought we'd do is we'd do it in a very sort of open way that you guys can understand it. And we'll use today, where we'll have a competition, but familiarise yourself with actually how the process works. Okay? Now, the different organisations have different slight variations on the rules. So, for example, the UKI gamblers' rules are slightly different from the WAO ones. So, if you ever qualify and you go to these big events, do make sure you read the rule books, okay? Because there are slight differences that can actually affect how the game works, alright? Is by completing obstacles correctly. That is only relevant if you score on the obstacle. Okay, so you're coming over and your dog jumps over it, you wouldn't score. As a judge, I will shout no quite clearly. The scribe will hear it, you will hear it. So then you can turn around and attempt it because you haven't scored on it. Okay, so you could go back if you wanted to. All right, but you can only score the obstacles a maximum of twice. So you can't stay by the dog walk doing dog walk, <laughs> jump, dog walk, jump because you can only score it twice. Again, it's about strategy, it's about playing to your strengths. Okay, you can have some fun with this as well. All right. When you're running, either myself, the judge, I'll be talking to the scribe. Okay, scribe will be stood behind me or close to me and I'll be going two, one, five, whatever. Okay, so I'll be listing and I, those numbers will be relevant to what you see. If you hear me say no, it'll only be on the contacts and it'll be because the obstacle has not been done properly.